Hello beautiful people of the internet and welcome back to another video. This time I have a new tutorial for you since some of you ask how it's possible to get colored world names in Minecraft. I am going to answer this question today. So here's how such a colored world name looks like and here's what you need for this to work. The program NPT Explorer. So where do you get that? Well, you just google for it or quickly click on the link in the video description. Then scroll down on that page until you see the download link. Now choose one of those links depending on wherever you use Windows, Linux or a Mac computer. Now just click on the NBT Explorer MSI file and download it. You could download the zip file as well, but I prefer the MSI one. Now, when the download is complete, the file is probably in your downloads folder. Go there and open it and click through the setup and then finally install the program. Now just put the little tick into launch NPT Explorer and click on finish. If you forgot to put the tick in there and now the program doesn't open, you should be able to find the program manually as well. Just go to your computer, open the C hard drive, then click on program files x86 and then the folder NVT Explorer. There is your program as well, just click on it to open it. Now that the program is open, you see all of your current worlds in there. Just click on the plus in front of the world which you want to have a colored name. Then click on level.dat and then on data. Now somewhere in all of those things you should find the point level name. And that is where the magic is going to happen. Just double click on it and there you have your world name in a new window. Now there are different codes you can enter to change the color of the text. For example write a section sign followed by a 2 in front of the world name to make it green. Now just click on the save symbol at the top and the world name should look green when you get into Minecraft. But this isn't the only code you can enter, there are actually a lot of them for all the different colors. Here's a list of all of those which you can use. Besides that you can also have a world name consisting of multiple colors. For example if you have a world called my world and you want the my to look red and the world look yellow, just put a section sign and an E in front of the my for the yellow color and a section sign and a Z in front of the world for the red color. Now save and when you get back into Minecraft you have a nice yellow red world name. So this was pretty much the whole tutorial. I hope you've enjoyed it and that I could answer all your questions. I will hopefully see you in my next video again and I wish you a nice day and bye bye.